This week we've had the launch of the most important climate science report for many years. It's the latest assessment of the physical science of the climate system from the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change. It covers how humans are influencing the climate, how we are driving more extreme heat waves, storms and floods, and why we must now do everything we possibly can to reduce greenhouse gas emissions to end the burning of coal, oil and gas if we were to avoid a future of much greater harms. Now this report comes during an absolutely critical year for international cooperation on climate change. A year that will culminate at COP26 in Glasgow in November, at which all countries, but especially the big polluters and the laggards like Australia, must step up their commitments to action. It also comes in a year in which the brute reality of climate change has once again bitten down really hard, with unprecedented heat waves, floods and fires across much of the Northern Hemisphere. But look, this report also shows that we can avoid a future of truly catastrophic warming. But it's going to take everything we've got, and this may be our final warning. Australia has so much potential to be part of the solution, we know that, and it's up to all of us to make sure that happens.